Okay, I just wanted to show you how I organized my Cricut cartridges. I bought these um, photo boxes, two of them, um, and they're labeled in the front with uh, uh, alphabets of what's inside. Um, so A through M is in here. So I have um, like Animal Kingdom. You go in there, and then you, if you look down, I don't know if you can see that. If I can lift this up a bit. All right. So here, here's camp out. So you look at the index, and then camp out is in here with this cartridge and a little case and the keypad and the book. Um, also, here's one. This is Christmas cheer, and here's the cartridge. Here's the pad, and here's the book. Um, make room, of course, I've ripped out everything that's not in English in the book so that I have more room. These um, indexes I put on my um, Cricut Design Studio to make the right size that I wanted, and they are from, from my kitchen, which is right here. They're in this um, book, which is a really nice Cricut cartridge. Um, these holders that I made for the Cricut cartridges, they fit in there real nice, which I'll show you. One here. Um, there's room to play, but, uh, you know, they just fit in there real nice. Like this, I'm doing this through the camera without looking there. I did label the tops because that was an old storage, um, way I was doing it before, but now I'm doing it in like this. So, and then there's a hole cut out in the front where you can read what the cartridges. But these are in tags, bags, boxes, and more. They're the shopping cart, this one here. Um, and I cut them at three inches. So, and I scored them and uh, taped them shut so they're real secure. So, uh, I really like this way of storing my Cricut cartridges because they're really easy to see and find. Um, it'd be nice if I could find boxes plastic photo boxes the same size that um, have handles and that close securely. But until I do, this will work. Thanks for watching. Bye.